The next section we'll be going over is the Estimate and Job Ticket Manager. This is a tool created for you to manage and maintain your quotes as well as job tickets. These buttons are represented by a piece of paper going into a folder for the Estimate Manager, as well as the piece of paper coming out of the folder for the Job Ticket Manager. To open the Estimate Manager, first click on the button that looks like a piece of paper going into the folder. This will open your Estimate Manager window. In here you can store all of your customer quotes. There are also options for active estimates as well as inactive estimates. The difference being that all the quotes you have pending would be active estimates, and all the quotes that you don't have pending would be inactive. To move an estimate to the inactive folder, first highlight the estimate and click the inactive button. It's represented by a gray and white piece of paper with a red arrow at the top of the sheets. This will move your estimate from the active folder into the inactive folder. To view the inactive folder, select the toggle inactive button represented by two windows with the red arrow at the tops of the windows. This will bring you to your inactive page. If you'd like to move an inactive quote back into the active window, highlight the estimate, and then select the activate button with the est within the estimate inactive window. This will move it back into the active window, and by selecting the toggle active, it brings us back into the active window where we can see that the estimate was brought back into the active estimate manager. The top toolbar here of this window will show you exactly which window that you're located in. Within this window, you can also create, edit, and delete estimates out of this window. We also have a filter option here to help you locate estimates faster. To utilize the filter, click on the button that looks like an oil filter. This will open the filter window. In here, you can type the name of the job, estimate, or description. You can also use the checkboxes to search by specifics. There's also an area for here to search by date range if you'd like as well.